Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm here with my A10M printer by GEE Tech. And I had a user ask me on one of my videos, how do you get it to print a prime tower? So, my friends, let's see the steps that I've got for a prime tower to show up. So, my friends, here we are with the A10M, and a user asked me about how to get a prime tower to work with Cura 4.21. So let me show you what I got going on and how it is working so far. So back on the prepare tab, I used my normal extra fast and then I simply went down to dual extrusion and I put a check mark in the prime tower. I picked the size of 20 millimeters and then I located it 100 by 100 so that it would be close to my shape. I chose print via USB and here we are with my little tower printing right now right beside the shape now I'm not sure I'm getting my dual colors oh maybe there is pink under there now I do see it and I do notice that that prime tower is not working for both halves but then maybe I don't have to because it is switching from the blue to the pink so why keep doing the prime tower when it's staying one color so to make it a dual color print I simply clicked on each piece so I made my centimeter cube five millimeters high and I did that for each of them and then I actually changed the X and Y location so that they could sit where I needed them. And then the last part was making one of them with extruder two instead of extruder one. And there we had the finished product where it did do a prime tower, although I'm not going to say it's the best looking prime tower and I do have a sweet two color shape. Alrighty friends, so here is my finished little cube, uh, five millimeters in each direction. I'm not sure how well my prime tower worked. You can see there's actually more of the blue than there is, so there might be a mix in there. Uh, but you can see there was a prime tower, and now it's just a matter of honing it down so it does exactly what we want. Friends, if you found the video useful, please hit a like. If you've got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit the notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.